From the Kenya Defense Forces headquarters in Nairobi, this is KDF News Update. I'm Sergeant Caroline Ghana. The United States Africa Command, U.S. AFRICOM, has awarded three Kenya Defense Forces service personnel with the Joint Service Commendation Medals for their heroic actions during the 5th January 2020 Al-Shabaab attack at Manda Bay in Lamu County. Our reporter with more details. The United States African Command has awarded three Kenya Defense Forces service personnel with the Joint Service Commendation Medals for their heroic action during the 5th January 2020 Al-Shabaab attack at Mandabez in Lamu County. The U.S. AFRICOM Director of Operations, Major General Gregory Anderson, awarded Colonel Daniel Rotich, Major Martin Mudaura, and Corporal Peter Shikuri with the meritorious awards for their swift response in countering and thwarting the terrorists that had attacked camps Simba in Manda that hosts KDF and U.S. military. Colonel Rotich, as the deputy commander of Operation Fagiam C2 at that time, was recognized for his technical acumen of coordinating air-to-ground support throughout the lethal engagement with the militia. He was responsible for the McDonnell Douglas 500 Defender Helicopter minigun engagements that engaged the momentum of the firefight between the United States and Kenya Defense Forces against the terrorists. United States military forces and Kenya Defense Force personnel maneuvered and fired on the Al-Shabaab positions until the enemy was neutralized and they regained full control of the, of the fight. The distinctive accomplishments of Lieutenant Colonel Radish reflect great credit upon himself, the Kenya Defense Forces, and the Department of Defense. Major Mudaura, as the Alpha Company commander of the Kenya Ranger Regiment, received the award for his ability to assemble a platoon-sized element of his troops and providing one squad to support the U.S. forces at the airfield. He took another squad to the jungle that surrounded the airbase and assaulted the terrorists without concern of his own personal welfare to successfully clear the perimeter of all enemy forces. Major Thuras' superior leadership, courage under fire, and dedication to duty were critical in the defeat of a platoon-sized element of Al-Shabaab terrorists who attacked the United States service members and contractors at the airfield at Manda Bay, Kenya. On the other hand, Corporal Shikuri was awarded for his dedication to duty and determination to prevail against the enemy. His efforts were critical in the defeat of the terrorists. He demonstrated incredible initiative and bravery during the assault on the terrorists even after being wounded. Speaking during the award ceremony, Major General Anderson thanked the three warriors for their teamwork, value and confidence which were instrumental in fighting the militia during the attack. And the Kenyan Rangers, by the way, are well, well respected by, uh, by American Rangers. I spent a lot of time with them, but the Rangers came in to close with to destroy the enemy. And then for uh, Corporal Nana to fight and continue to fight while wounded is one of the ultimate expressions of, uh, of courage. He said that the U.S. AFRICOM remains determined to partner with Kenya in fight against terrorism, which has become a global threat. Your patriotism uh, to Kenya, your willingness to fight a tough and determined enemy, uh, that's a global threat to, to us all, uh, and then to come to the need of, Amer of my countrymen uh, when they are in a position to be hurt really bad that day. We'll, we'll never forget that, and uh, we'll just continue to be grateful for our partnership with, with you and all at Kenya and the Kenyan Defense Forces. Vice Chief of Defense Forces, Lieutenant General Francis Ogola, hailed the three gallant soldiers, saying they demonstrated the spirit of the Kenyan troops in adherence to the oath they signed to defend the sovereignty and territorial integrity of the Republic of Kenya. He said that KDF recognizes all the soldiers who participated in various ways in countering the terrorists, saying that their input contributed to the successful defeat of the enemy. The three of you represent the spirit of the Kenyan troops and you receiving this medal is representative of everyone who took part. The VCDF thanked U.S. AFRICOM saying they have been long-time KDF partners in counter-terrorism and training of troops.
Reporting for KDF News, I am Senior Private Kibwanga Ferdinand. Thank you for watching. I'm Sergeant Caroline Ngana. Do enjoy the rest of your viewing.